Hey everybody, my name is Matt Kunzler. I am a technology advisor with Henry Schein. I'm here today to show you a little bit about the PrimeScan Connect unit from Densply Serona. This is my handsome son, Colin. He's going to be my demo patient. What we want to show you today in today's video is the ability to scan and capture a full arch uh, very quickly, very efficiently. A couple things about the PrimeScan Connect. Uh, this is a laptop version of the scanner, and that makes it really easy to incorporate into any office. You can set it up like this, where it's back on a countertop. You can put it on a rolling cart, uh, but nice that it's very portable. And uh, now we have the ability to take it from office to office if you'd like to uh, in a nice, easy format. If uh, you've seen any of my previous videos and you'd like to be informed of any ones that are coming out in the future, uh, make sure to hit the like and subscribe uh, buttons uh, for this video. Thank you. All right, we're going to get started. Um, first thing we're going to do, the prime scan is in sleep mode right now. So all I have to do is pick up the scanner and the scanner will initiate and come on. Uh, just like the other prime scan, it's got a built in heater. So we don't have to worry about fogging or any of those things. So I will have Colin open. And just like with the other scanner, I have my audible feedback. I have my audible feedback letting me know that I am scanning. There we go. Now we got it. And sometimes, but I just want to, when scanning, the different uh, tones of the scanner are letting me know whether I'm capturing or not. It's really convenient because now I don't have to be looking at the monitor. Notice the monitor is behind me in this case, and I want to stay in a nice ergonomic position. Therefore, the audible feedback is really helpful because I don't have to twist my neck or my elbow. Although I'm going to right now because I'm not 100% sure why it's not capturing. There we go. All right. So I'm going to come back here and just take a quick look and evaluate what I got. And we're going to see that I have a nice, very complete skin. That took about less than a minute, I'd say. If I wanted to, I can come back in and capture some of that tissue right there. And I think I'm going to do that. If this were an ortho case, I think that'd be very important. So we want to just come back in and make sure we get all that nice tissue there just to complete the scan. Okay, so even with a couple of uh, hiccups there, and maybe I'm a little rusty scanning, um, very fast to be able to scan. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to go to the upper. Okay. And have you open. Right. All right, now we're cooking. You notice that when I scan, I like to scan with the uh, my my hands moving together. Uh, start on the occlusal surface, and then my hands work together while one is retracting, and the other is moving together. Okay, now we'll finish off on the lingual. Also, if you don't like this tone, you are able to change it. It does have music that maybe you'd like a little better if you didn't like this uh, particular sound at you. Well, let's see, I'm just going to take one more quick pass around the ginger, but make sure we got all those interproximals. Make sure we got all the nice tissue. I'm also shaking a little bit. I think I had too much coffee today. Let's see. And next time I'm going to change the tone of this. I think I've decided that. Okay, there's the upper. Okay, we're going to do the bite. Um, in this case, I'm going to turn the scanner off. Go ahead and open, Colin, and bite, and stay biting. And I'm just going to scan, 
See how quickly that comes into play? So that was good. I'm going to turn the scanner off one more time so that we can scan the other side as well. Go ahead and open and bite and stay biting. All right. And there we go. Pretty painless. Um, don't have a timer going or anything like that, but I'd say that was just a couple of minutes to be able to scan upper, lower, and bite. Once we go into the modeling uh, component of the software, we're able to look at things like occlusion, uh, so that your contact spots, we're able to do all sorts of other neat things. Um, anyways, and, and it's perfect for treatment planning, case presentation, all sorts of other things that you can do in the office. This isn't just about scanning and sending to the lab anymore. Now there's, there's a, a world of things that we can do with these scans. Well, if you like today's video, please, again, hit the like and subscribe. And uh, I appreciate your time today.